Welcome back, guys. This is on Flickr with Flo Flo. Let's keep the conversation going on our social media platforms. That is at KUTV Kenya, Facebook at KUTV Kenya, Twitter at KUTV Kenya, Instagram, and we also live on YouTube. The WhatsApp number is 0739110544. With me here, I have a guest, an esteemed guest, uh, someone that I've seen grow, and it's actually his first interview. So, yeah. welcome to the building. Thank you so much. Yes. Uh, can you tell us who you are? I am, my name is Willy Davido. Yeah. I am a content creator. Mm hmm Yeah. Uh, just that. What type of content do you create? I was a I was a journalist um, right here at mm -hmm. KUTV, mm -hmm. so that is the place that um, gave me the um, basis. idea. Yeah, the, the basis. basis. Yeah, mm -hmm. because in KU, I was fresh from university. I had not, I did not have a lot of experience. So after that, I left and then uh, went into digital media. Mm -hmm. So I create, uh, went out to create my own digital space, and that is really Davido TV. A branded it as really Davido TV. Why really Davido? Um, Willie is my name. Growing up, everyone uh, used to call me Willie. Davido is a name I got in campus. So uh, yeah, that is why Willie Davido TV. Davido. Yeah. Actually, someone can say you're, you're Davido, like the Davido the musician. Yeah. So, the content creation space has welcomed you, because I'm also a content creator myself. Mm -hmm. How has it been so far since you left from... You are a reporter, actually. Yeah. Yeah. How is it? How is the transition? Yeah. I was a, I was a news reporter. Mm -hmm. And um, even before I began reporting news, Hapa KU, mm -hmm. I was... I was Stacy, this is what happened. Mm -hmm. I finished camp. I finished high school, mm -hmm. and I knew what I wanted to do. Mm -hmm. I knew I want to do journalism. Mm -hmm. So even before I joined campus, uh, I started a YouTube channel mm -hmm. back then, mm -hmm. and um, I went on mm -hmm. until 2019. Everything was going so well until 2019, and then the pandemic came, and that is when everything changed. Life changed, but uh, the journey has been amazing. Uh, the support has been great. Yes. We can see even the branding because you have an, is it an overall? Yes, it is an overall. An overall yeah. and it's such unique because we've seen people with t-shirts, never really an overall and yeah. it puts you in like when you have two overall, you can see Exactly, exactly. Yeah, yeah so um, when I the, the WD is Willy Davido. WD is Willy Davido. Uh -huh. At the back, it has my logo and my name, Willy Davido TV. Willy Online Davido TV. TV. Yeah. Online TV. Yeah. You guys, uh, this person has gotten to interview the people. When you want to kuni kuniambia to to put his connections because honestly, um. So who and who have you met and have you interviewed and how do you get to meet these people? Honestly, um, I've met a lot of great people. And um, on my YouTube, I have interviewed Seth Kaur, mm -hmm. he's a content creator. Mm -hmm. I have interviewed my friends, uh, Akina Mchina, mm -hmm. Akina Adi Pluto. Mm -hmm. That was in 2019, back then before our the, the pandemic. How come you answer stories again? Test. Yeah, loyalty uh -huh. and yeah. So how I get to meet them, I can't really. You see, I feel like uh, you attract uh, what you want. Yes. Mm -hmm. The people that you need to meet, you're going to meet them. The people that you're supposed to meet in your life, you're going you to meet, meet them. them. Yeah. Mm -hmm. As long as you want to. So you told me you saw yourself doing journalism ever since. Yeah. That is what you studied for, right? Yeah. Did you finish your studies? I did finish my studies at Zitek University. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I finished. Mm. <laughs> So, maybe no many peer pressure. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> because he's an interviewee. Interview, interviewer. Interviewer. Yeah. So, you're the interviewee, but you come on a film coming on a interview. <laughs> There's a pressure. I don't mean you're going feel pressure. By the way, Stacey, I was told on my way here, uh -huh. uh, Beshti Angu Flani and I told Maxi. Mm -hmm. I can mm -hmm. when you get to studio, mm -hmm. we say hi to Stacey and Bobo mm -hmm. and tell them that they are doing a great job, so we'll be watching. So. Oh. Yeah. Shout out to you, Maxine, because God, tell me you're a bosha. Thank you, guys. You know the who's who's. Yeah. So, what do you think you can change in the content creation industry that can help us have a better future? Um, 
Wow, that's a good question. What can I change? Mm-hmm. I can only be myself. Mm-hmm. I can only do things the way I can do them because Stacy you're a unique person and you're that's the right. only person that can sit there mm-hmm. and do what you're doing that, that way. way. Yeah. That's right. So the only thing I can do to make a difference in my uh, in my space in mm-hmm. my um uh in the in the in the content creation field is mm-hmm. be unique, be myself. Yeah. And everything will flow. Exactly. Yes. So <laughs> Do you see yourself doing content creation for the rest of the time? Back in high school, um, I think this is where it began in high school. Nilikuwa pale um, journalism club, mm-hmm. Napia Christian Union. So I saw myself yeah, doing journalism. I saw myself getting into this, mm-hmm. and this is what I wanted. You know, for some people, it is a challenge to um, find what you love. So for me I know what I want mm-hmm. and I do not take that for granted there are some people bade aje aje gundua Kenya anataka kufanya mahali anataka kwenda and it's also a process mm-hmm. but uh, when you find what you love you go with it okay, that's right yeah and tell us the social media platforms where we can get to have you and we can get to get to see the interviews what's the latest interview you've done the latest interview I've done was with uh, a TikTok sensation mm-hmm. anaitwa Nathan Hanif. Mhm. Uh, Anakuaga pale kwa Reverend uh, Lucy Natasha. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so mm-hmm. that was the latest interview. Mm-hmm. There's also something Stacy you've not asked no. and ah! I really wanted to, to, to tell share. us. Okay, yeah. tell us. Uh-huh. During the pandemic, mm-hmm. um a lot of things you see uh, let me tell you this story the way it is. Mm-hmm. In 2019, mm-hmm. uh, I know you, right now you can you can say that this guy is somewhere. Mm-hmm. But in 2019, I was in campus and life was 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 good. Mm-hmm. And then 2020 came, mm-hmm. and I feel that I'm not the only one. In so terms I'm of saying life was good, how was life? Can you can you tell us? Um, yeah, life was good because I had the opportunities that I wanted. I had a YouTube channel that was doing so great. Mm-hmm. That is the time I was uh, doing interviews with the likes of the Pluto, mm-hmm. China, mm-hmm. and everything was flowing so well mm-hmm. until 2020. Came, yes, yeah. yes. Mm-hmm. So I feel I'm not the only person that w- um, the pandemic changed life for yeah, for everyone. everyone, and especially for content creators. It is true that there are some content creators that emerged during that period. Mm-hmm. Now, Kapata, your platform, and they are doing so great. But for me, it was the exact opposite. Mm-hmm. So your life your, as a content creator is going so well, mm-hmm. and then the pandemic comes. Um, and then you can't go out, you can't create content exactly. no more outside with the people you are, because you, you depend on people to do interviews on yeah, them. Yeah, yeah. so I went back home, and... Um, during that 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 period uh, my life took a different route mm-hmm. but either way i've still it some of some some people might see it uh, during that period was on and you listen you see people when you wanna watch show mm-hmm. when you stop doing it wataanza kukuuliza hey stacy kwa nini atukuoni kwa show mm-hmm. so, because honestly i saw that last one for Nathan Hanif and yeah. i'm like i thought there was another one that's why in school there, yeah. there i keep tracks one. i keep i'm a loyal viewer <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. yeah. So the pandemic affected uh, content creators in different ways. Kuna wale ambao mambo ilibadilika and uh, like for me I disappeared from YouTube for a, a long while. And what do you think can be done to change that? Because uh, there's always a solution at the end of the tunnel. Mm-hmm. What can be done is to remain consistent. Mm-hmm. If you know this is what I want to do, this mm-hmm. is my field just remain consistent sometimes it is not easy for content creators to 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 remain consistent Mm -hmm. especially because they are human beings too and they have prevailing needs content you have bills to pay mm-hmm. and for some content creators they are not paid immediately at upcoming artists on zile mm-hmm. financial mm-hmm. challenges Strings thing that yeah they have. yeah because yeah. they are not paid immediately but remain mm-hmm. consistent okay guys we have it follow him on all social media platforms that is Willie Davido we're going on a very short break we'll be 